Look, a question I get a lot on television and in regular conversation is, can he do that? Can mm -hmm. the president do that? And what I, my answer is that's the wrong question. Uh, the question is, if he does that, and we've had up until now presidents who don't cross certain boundaries, what's the consequence? What are the processes for holding a president accountable? The book breaks that down, right? So there's either Congress, there are the courts, which would, would exercise their power through Robert Mueller if he could do an indictment, for example. Um, and then there is uh, the voting process in 2020 in the presidential election. So in the, the census question, uh, there's, a, there's a statute, the Census Act, which requires that there be a census April 1st, every 10 years, that's not something the president can change. So either he gets things together to respond to the Supreme Court's decision, get a, cha a different decision, and then get the printing press to add it by April 1st, or we're in a situation where he ignores an act of Congress.